keep pressure on her here, push her up the middle of the pen, but not scare her. And now I'm gonna let my horse have her. Dude, we just need to be comfortable right here. Fight her off. You're Dial in. Right there if you can get up here. See, this cow's gonna try to run me over in this corner if I don't stay accurate with her. Stay accurate. Fight her off. Just like that. Like right here. As, as a helper, this cow's telling us it's a lot. So right here, he's got total control, and we're gonna Reed. build confidence in him, but we can't do a lot of moving. Reed it. Let him do the controlling. He can step up right to that there. cow and start it himself. And it's like here, I'm, I'm just, like I say, I'm filling my horse out. Can I turn her, can I move her, place her where to make a good clean cut because this where the run starts is cutting where I can ride her up there and start my cow like that see now I'm back in control I'm getting my points back that I took away on my first cow cow release me just wait there see I want to keep her keep her in tense with the cow hold of me and the cow not a hold of me here we get back in here, let her think, wait now, wait there. There, little angles off just a skosh right there. So I'll stick her back there again. We'll go right back to what we started with is we're trying to build confidence. And like, knock on wood, all, all of them, we've been here now for a month or so. About, yeah. Oh, and we've worked like this every day and when a lot of a lot of us, including us, we work around a lot. So put our cows in the middle. Well, when, you know, of course we show like this, flat. So working like this in this show situation also gets us confident about going 